You release comment from Nikita? Really? Are you serious? Where? Is that the one what new DDL said? Oh, good lord. Is that the one? More feedback. It says more feedback. Just now? Five minutes ago. Good lord. Give me a sec. Let me do an X post. <laughs> or let's read it first. God dang it. I was doing my thing. All right. More feedback. Greetings. Let me continue my feedback on its Nikita COO, guys. My feedback on the current situation. First of all, I would like to say I am very sorry that fans... What? He says sorry? I have never seen that. Did he ever say sorry? <laughs> that fans and the game community in general are experiencing these feelings. Unfortunately, I somehow did not foresee the fact of such a reaction and now I have drawn conclusions for my future decisions. Now I will briefly summarize the main points. About PPE access, we decided to just open to the EOD owners for free, but we will do it in waves. As I said before, okay, that's at least a good thing. We don't have server capacity right now. We will start this process as soon as possible. Okay, that is good. Um, we also decided that we will add mod support for PPE mode after really <laughs> really what are you serious he's basically enabling most support i mean you know he lied multiple times so we know we don't know if it's gonna be true but at least he mentioned that we're archiving it at least wow okay give me a sec i i want to do a tweet post saying that we won <laughs> We won, it seems, for now. Okay. About the Unheard Edition, we will not remove it. We want to keep the option for those who want to support the game more. Okay, that is okay-ish, but the game-breaking parts, you might have to do something about it. And then also... <sighs> alright, alright. A lot of things are covered at, at this point. But the game breaking part, but we will balance items, perks in this edition, as well as we'll provide give me a sec, more rewards for those who upgraded with the old price, okay? New EOD perks will be balanced too. We will remove prioritized matching option to keep everyone in the same spot, and we will add more unique stuff to highlight the EOD version in general. We will provide the final list of the new EOD perks ASAP. We continue to work on patches, new contents, events, and the game release itself no matter what. Thank you for the time, love and hate. <laughs> okay. <sighs> EOD owners will receive all the DLCs, man. Okay. All of the DLCs, right? You are not gonna mention anything else Please don't say, please next time, don't make DLC, I don't make DLC, uh, don't say DLC is not a DLC, let's just say that, don't say DLC is not a DLC. Bro. I think we got like quite a quite a win in this part for sure. Actually, it's it's a, it's a lot of win. This is good, isn't it, guys? I like in my experience, guys. I've never seen him saying sorry to the fans ever, even though like if it's true or not. And then, um, yeah, you were stupid enough to say this. This is not gonna be like dramatic. Like it's anyways. Again, I'll I'll mention it again just in case you guys just came over. PBE access, we decided to do give it to the EOD owners for free. It's a very good thing for the EOD owners to be honored because they are the first biggest supporters. And um I mean I still hope like they will let everyone to try it out with maybe some purchases. Not freely, obviously. Maybe or even even free, but that's just my wish. 
but this is already quite W and as I said before, we don't have service right now. So it will be in waves. We will start this process as soon as possible. We also decided that we will add mod support. So this is going to be like Steam mod support, right? Not saying like there's going to be like a Tarkum mod just randomly sitting there and supporting you, <laughs> right? For PBE mode after release of the game, bro. That is, this is the biggest part, I think. This, this is exactly what SPT was doing. And they are, I hope they collaborate, but I don't know how they're going to do that. But anyways, I think this is a pretty big, pretty, pretty big. There was only one option. Yeah, that's what I was saying, AC3, but like they were acting like stupid. They were like, yesterday they were asking like, <laughs> okay. Can you guys, uh, like, like, um, can you guys, can we do this, you know? <laughs> can we do that? Mm. It would be interesting to hear your thoughts on this idea. Mm. <laughs> they were doing that, but now he actually, you know, at least, guys, but be careful, guys, be careful. He might be lying again because he did before. He literally deleted stops. And we need to be careful to not fully trust. We need to actually be cautious and look at what he does. We need to see it, guys. Oh, guys, the, the guys who bought like the next edition, don't worry about it. We will not remove it. We want to keep the option for those who want to support the game more. But we will balance items and perks in this edition, which is unba like unbalanced, like super overpowered. As well as we will provide more rewards for those who upgraded with the whole price. <sighs> New EOD perks will be balanced too. We will remove prioritized matchmaking option to keep everyone in the same spot and we will add more unique stuff to highlight the EOD version in general. Bro, like, how did you not think of this? Like, I mean, before, we will provide the final list of the EOD perks ASAP. It's good, it's good. He's, he's moving fast. Okay, guys, guys, calm down. I need to make an outro. Guys, this looks like we actually got a quite a W from like all of you community actions. I was just posting random videos. It's all your doings. Seems like. Hope you guys are happy about it. Oh, at least a little bit. It's still like a you know you got you got a freaking backslap and then he suddenly says I'm sorry and handshake. <laughs> it's that that kind of opinion uh, that kind of situation still, still not recognizing the B no 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 this part. EOD owners will receive all the all of the DLCs. He said oh, the DLC is PBE, basically. He didn't exactly say it. But he's basically saying that. I mean, am I being trapped again? <laughs> that ain't happening. I know, I know, Pirate of the Sea. I, I still think like this might be a lie again just to put off the fire. But we need to... We at least got like a confirmation from the COO. At least, guys, like... I don't know, it seems like shady, it seems a little bit shady, but still. Completely walked it back. Yes, it seems like. Not fully uh, walked back, because Unheard Edition is not gonna go away, because... Oh, wait, I need to mention this part too, though. Okay, guys, I, I already made the outro, but I'll, I'll quickly add this part, because... Um, some people are saying that PBE mode is still not DLC, but... What he said up there, and then adding this part, seems like... The, he's accepting that the DLC, uh, the PBE mode is a DLC. And also, um, what was the other one? I forgot what, I, I forgot the last one. Yeah, we need to still be careful about his promises. You know, he has broken promises a lot. Okay. But thank you guys for watching. If you guys like these kind of contents, Please leave a like and also if you guys want to check out the video as quick as possible put on the notification button on and also If you want to check out the other videos is um, on the screen it's on the screen and if you want to check out my live stream check out the live stream uh, Which is on the description very best get bio link. I'll see you in the next video guys. Goodbye Thank you For the support guys